Meanwhile, civil society organizations in Nigeria have called for the amendment of the nation's controversial companies and Allied Matters Act 2020, as known as CAMA Act. The executive director of Global Rights, Abiodo Baye, was speaking at an event organized by the International Human Rights Watchdog, Global Rights, with the theme, The Camera Shrinking Our Square. A critical dialogue said that the Review Camera Act restricts CSOs and NGOs, both incorporated as a non-profit organizations act, by all members of civil society organizations in Nigeria to challenge sections of the Act that are problematic and work towards proposing amendments in the future. The NGO bill was also an effort at doing exactly the same thing. So there's been a concerted, consistent, deliberate effort to incapacitate civil society, render it so incapable that they do not become a force, an alternative to political voices that are active. Uh, so if you're then in a situation in which the political opposition is weak, the uh, citizens are mostly pauperized and impoverished, and therefore their concern really is for what they eat on a day-to-day -day basis. And the civic space of, of active, organized civic sector is itself uh, endangered. Organized labor is discredited and bereft of money. What you have is an authoritarian state. And that's where we're headed. As 2020 has a lot of, while it's a very good law for the business sector, for the profit-making sector, it's very um, restrictive on civil society organizations. That would include, of course, NGOs, um, churches, mosques, um, ASUSU groups, and, and, and everybody incorporated as a non-profit under the CAC. Uh, and um, it's our duty to collectively think about these issues and challenge them. Uh, and that is what we're trying to do here today. For example, how does, there are so many subjective sections to the Kama, and those subjective sections means that um, the, the companies and allied, um, the uh, Corporate Affairs Commission can at any time step in to an organization as long as um, people, politically exposed people are not happy with the organization, which will make accountability more difficult. And uh, as the 2023 elections approach us, we need as a society to also begin to ask for politicians who will be respectful of our civic space, who will... Um, seek to build a society in which the voice of the people can be heard rather than suppressed and that is what this meeting is about hello hope you enjoyed the news please do subscribe to our youtube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates